Hey guys, this is SecEngine1. Tiana has sent over their latest powerful Wi-Fi 6A router that is still not in the market. It is equipped with Broadcom 1.7 GHz quad-core CPU and internet speed peaks at 5.7 GB per second. So you can enjoy streaming in 8K or 4K videos and enjoy zero buffers or zero latency when using AR or VR gaming. Inside the box, we got the regular charger Ethernet cable and finally the router itself. The quality is not that premium, it is light, it is decent, not that great, but compared to any routers I had owned previously, be it TP Link, T Link, or any routers previously from my sponsors, this one, the material does feel cheap. When you power on the router, you only get one power indicator. But do bear in mind that there is no other indicator for Wi-Fi, LAN, or internet like any other router, which is a huge bummer. However, we will see if the internet speed between 5-year-old router and Tenda has any major difference in speed and latency. So the first contender is the Tenda Wi-Fi 6E on the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra and let's see how the speed is. Just to let you guys know, I switched off both the routers for 5 minutes, then turned them on at the same spot, just to make it fair. Now, I'm gonna connect to my old router with 5G and see how the speed is. So as you can see, the older router wins with higher download speeds, even the upload, the ping seems to be the same, even the jitter shows that the older router is much more stable. So we are going to test out the 2.4 GHz and we'll end the video from there. Now, when it comes to 2.4 GHz, we notice that it is very similar in download speed, the ping, and the jitter. But when it comes to upload, I'm not sure what exactly happened, if it's an issue with the server of testing the internet. But it seems that the older router is at 66 MB per second, while the Tinder is 121, so two times the upload speed in 2.4 GHz. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this short video. Do like, subscribe, and comment below, and see you in the next one. Peace out.